So this time let's set up some a hood so when we collect a collectible it reflects. And we're going to do so by first of all creating a new folder which we'll call UIs or widgets and then we need to right click it in space, go to user interface and create a widget blueprint which we'll just call uh, the hood just for now. I'm just going to be and open that up and we're just going to stick some simple text in there just to make sure that this text works and uh, we need to actually apply it so i'm just going to go to blueprint and open my level blueprint and get an event begin play and that event begin play is going to create a widget the widget is obviously going to be a new widget and now we've created we actually need to add it to our viewport so we can see it so let's compile that and test it we can see that widget excellent all right so in the widget uh we're going to need a variable now we'd actually normally see this even like on the player or in the game instance but for now we're just going to create a variable okay. on the hood um, and that is going to be called score and we're going to change its type from boolean to integer and back in the designer we're going to change the text block and click this bind button where you change the text we're going to change it to scope and let's also just make it a bit bigger let's say it's like 48 double the size and you know what actually let's make it look nicer by getting another text block um, and send this to just pass some text and say score set this to 48 and that should be nice but on our collectible uh, we need to open our collectible and we need to set and increase the number okay. so before we destroy the axe I'm just going to alt click to break that so we're going to begin overlap with our flying pawn and then we are going to let's just get all widgets of class okay. now we could have lots of widgets but we've only got the one hood so we need to get a copy of the one because we only have the one so that's fine from here we're going to need a get score and a set score so I'm just dragging off them and creating these two points now very simply we're going to get the score we're going to increase the score by one or you can increase it by whatever number you want like 100 if you like big numbers and then we're going to set that to be a new score and then after we've done that we'll destroy the collectible so let's go to our game let's make sure we've got a couple of these so i'm just going to click it hold alt and drag off a few so we fly score decreases and score continues to increase there we go 